morning guys um welcome to tuesday video for the f1 and masters guys um today got a bit of a challenge uh set so it's i've got a set a little set routine of three different exercises okay uh and it's basically get a stopwatch or a timer on your phone and see how many repetitions of that set you can do in 20 minutes uh so it's quite a killer one uh, I'm going to go through, so this video I'm going to go through um, that and also I'm just going to go through some foam rolling stuff that we should be doing just every day, uh, just helping us, well, gain flexibility, recover your muscles, uh, just also just letting your body grow as well. Uh, so I'm going to go through some foam roller sort of moves that we can do, just three simple ones uh, that I want you to focus on. Okay, so our exercise is say, if you have uh, a skipping rope and somewhere that you can skip without sort of hitting the ceiling, I don't at the moment, um, hitting the ceiling or um, well, just not anyone else, um, then grab a skipping rope. Okay. Also need a bench or let's say a sofa for our dips or a chair um, for our dips and then also press ups. So what you're going to do, you're going to do 60 skips. And if you can't do the skips, all I want you to do is do our burnouts. So our burnouts is basically feet close together. Okay, you just jump in from side to side, imitating that you're skipping really. Okay, and one jump, one rep. Okay, same with skips, one rotation, one rep. Okay, so you're gonna do 60 skips, then into 10 dips, then into 10 uh, press ups. And with the press ups, guys, I want you to use what we did. Um, yesterday and take different various uh, press ups okay so that's whether or not it's the sort of the diamond press up the hindu press up the spine round press up um all of those uh, or uneven or even use let's say a ball if you've got a ball so you can sort of do making sure that you like that um mix your press ups up okay 10 press ups then into five burpees so you got 60 skips 10 dips, 10 press ups, vary them up each time, and then five burpees. Okay, so, so it's four exercises. Sorry, so it was three at the start. So, four exercises, 20 minutes. Just keep repeating it. Okay, keep pushing yourself to see how many times you can do that. Okay, and hopefully, well, by the end of it, you will be knackered. Uh, it'll be a good exercise, good little burn, good little hit session. Okay, make sure you have some water with you um, and make sure you're properly warmed up. So warming up for this, all I want to see is four, so four lots of one minute, sort of just jogging on the spot with 30 seconds worth of just sort of doing some dynamic stretches. So do minutes worth of jogging and then 10 inch worms or hip flexors or lunges, uh, then minutes worth of jogging then 10 sort of another exercise okay so break it up a bit make sure you're nice and ready and sort of ready to sort of just go for 20 minutes okay so have a little look at that that's our exercises for today uh, they're going to be on the description below so make sure you have a little look at the description below like the video get subscription so you know when all the videos are going out all the time uh, so have a little look at that other than that with our foam roller so hopefully everyone's got sort of some form of foam roller um, with them uh, or at home if not great bit of equipment not just for now that we're in sort of quarantine but for all of your sporting career um, I've got just a one that is this sort of comes with inside my normal big foam roller it's just a little bit more spongy uh, I was doing a lot of, sort of cardio work yesterday so I don't want something too hard on my muscles today uh, so these are quite good making sure that I know there's some sets that come in three and one that you get a you get a a uh, softer foam roller, a harder foam roller, and then also you might get a ball. Okay, so very good sort of tools. I'll go through how you can use sort of a ball, you can use any sort of kind of board, um, don't need to buy a specific one. So, first one that we just want to go through, what I want to do is just our hamstrings. Our hamstrings get used every day, okay, whether we like it or not. Okay, all I want you to do is just make sure you're just going to be sat on the floor. Okay, I'll try and do it this side. Okay, sat on the floor, you're just going to put your foam roll underneath, put your hands on the back, okay, 
and all it simply is is just rolling up and down okay all the way and let's say if you find a bit that's actually a little bit more tense so there you can just put a little bit more pressure on it and just lightly roll over it okay but other than that you can go all the way up and down the muscle okay trying to get that spot and that's just going to help recover your muscles okay and i want you to stick on each muscle for about a minute of rolling doing sort of little rolls okay and also our big rolls okay so other one which i want us to work on is our quad okay so we're on our front for this okay this one can be a bit sort of sometimes a little bit challenging okay but what you're going to do you're going to have your hands out in front of you okay and then you're just going to make sure you put the sort of put the foam roller sort of on your knee okay and all you're going to do is sort of as such roll into it okay support your body weight and you can control with that how much weight you want to put onto it onto your quad and how sort of much force you want to put into your foam rolling and yeah work all the way up and down the muscle okay going all the way from the top to the bottom if you're sort of struggling with that what you can do is sort of do it forcefully yourself you can grab your foam roller like this and sort of roll up the muscle okay and maybe find a spot there have a little roll out of it okay that's a good way of doing it okay so you don't just have to make this roll on the floor you can roll it out yourself like a sort of rolling pin in kind of way and our last one is a muscle that we don't really use it's more of a sort of a band um helps with our knee development and if we have any strength um pain in our knees uh, we probably need to roll it out it's a muscle that comes from our knee all the way up to our hip okay it's part of our contracept um but it's not that powerful it's not that big it's quite just sort of a long sort of line of flesh um of muscular flesh but it's quite hard to sort of strength uh, stretch out okay so it's very good to roll it out what you want to do okay you want to go just so i can show you the best you're going to go onto your side and you're going to put your leg out put your foam roller on your hip okay sort of grab something that you can sort of make sure and so on your side you're going to be there and all you're going to do is just roll up and down that bit of your leg just making sure you get that and it is going to hurt a little bit okay it's not the most comfortable pain um but it is going to see results so do have a little go with your foam roller after all of those exercises guys grab your foam roller have a foam roller though so one on your hamstring one on your quad one on the outside of your leg have a little go for that today uh, and then carry on having a roll out also find sort of different movements that can get different bits of um your legs your calves your core your back um your lower backs are really good for these uh these are really good for your lower back sorry um and everything so yeah uh have a little foam roll today guys i'll be touching upon sort of what we can do with a massage ball tomorrow so have fun guys and hopefully see you in your live sessions uh later on today um so keep well keep safe uh and enjoy the sunshine go out for your daily run or your your cycle uh, and have some fun thanks guys